This is John Garrison. Mr. President, good to see you. Good to see you. Thank you for your support. Well, Sally Garrison. Elizabeth Kershaw. Thomas Kershaw. Great to see you again, Mr. President. President. Sandra Perkins. Thank you so much for supporting Easter Seals. Please to thank all of you for what you're doing. We're taking five, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> it's a stage wave. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ad lib. Ad lib. Sure. Uh, <laughs> 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 This next man, Cat Boone. Hello. It's great. Good to see you. It's a sensation. Well, thank you. In top form, deep form. Thank you very much. Colonel George Cisneros. Colonel, thank you. Good to see you. Alvaro Cisneros. Thank you. My pleasure. Great to have you. Diane Denstead. Hello there. Nice to see you. Mm -hmm. Terry Denstead. Tremendous honor from the church. David Denstead. And the star, John Denstead. Well, it's good to see you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we want to get a group okay, of sure. all the Denstead, too. This? Okay. Can you take this? Yeah, 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 right around. Mr. Well, thank you very much. Thank you a lot of pictures of Sean. And I have a school that my whole school signed this. His entire school signed this for you. Take this. <laughs> And this is a Hillside Harry School. <laughs> Hillside Christmas. <laughs> and Mount Laurel, New Jersey. Hey, I want to. Can you back up a little bit? Oh, there we go. Nothing's going to keep him down. How about that? Now it's your turn. <laughs> <laughs> you find out that when you get to be my age, there's a rule that says you can't do that. They want to get a better picture. They will do it one more time. One more time. They're going to take it. They didn't get the picture the first time. <laughs> I tried it. Don't do it. Don't even try it. <laughs> okay. Take a rest. Put down your face and get ready. I'm going to have this company for 20 hours. I'm going to tell it. Well, Sean, I want to tell you, that's a wonderful thing you're going to do. You're going to be traveling all over the country. Yes. And you're going sir. to be helping people who have disabilities and so forth. And it's, it's a wonderful thing, and I know that that's also true Thank you, sir. of the Colonel yeah. here. And you'll be very busy, and that we know what you do year after year. <laughs> yeah. And the others of you that are involved in this cause, it's, it's really wonderful. Mm -hmm. And I'm very proud to have this, and the card, and the, the plaque that you presented to me. And I think that I should be giving you a souvenir. Oh! <laughs> should hand this to your mother because uh, this is a jar with engraved with the great seal of the United States. Oh. And inside the glass jar 
our jelly beans. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Well, you're more than welcome. You may be heard as a colonel. Here's a little bit of a picture for you. Here it is here. Are you Father of the Mayor of San Antonio. Yes, I am. I, I should have mentioned it sooner. Yes. 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 Quite a guy. Yes, yes. I met him several months ago. Good job. He put in 39 years in the Army, this man. <laughs> and I've forgiven your son for being in the Army. <laughs> He's our big kid. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sir, right here. That's fine. Thank you. Right. Okay. Great. Okay. <laughs> what was that Roger Miller song? You can't roller skate in a buffalo herd. <laughs> <laughs> Turns out you can uh, skate anywhere. Yeah. You, you can't say you can't skateboard in the Oval Office now because it's been done. <laughs> I'm a military myself. I was a reserve officer who wound up in World War II a captain. Let's move on out. Oh, sorry. Oh, yes. Very much so. Yes. As well. I have, a, I have a little joke. I'm going to be offended if I tell you this little joke. What? I guess. This is an awful joke. It was a janitor for the company that came in 10 minutes late and the boss was waiting for him. He said, when you were in the service, what did they say when you came in 10 minutes late? He says, oh, they just stood up, saluted, and said, good morning, Colonel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're going to do two family photos. Why don't we do the Cisneros family here first, and then we'll do the Denison family. Okay. Uh, okay. Just there. Yeah. Yeah. Sir, sir, right here. That's Say Henry. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now, we're right. yeah. now we're going to do the right. Denison family. I am more red today, thinking that uh, Nancy just might be here. <laughs> she's, she's in New York. Is she, yeah, she's doing a dinner oh, award of some kind. That's Jimmy Stewart. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's, that's great. great. <laughs> that's great. Thank you. Great. Oh, thank, thank, you. thank you. Thank you again, Mr. Jimmy's, Jimmy's what, 80? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank you very much. Okay. Isn't Jimmy Stewart 80 years old? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The great thing about this okay, is that'll do us everything. All right. Uh, well, hello and welcome. Thanks. Well, I'm so happy to see you. Well, happy to see you. My dear friend. You know that. Yeah. 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 You know, Secretary. Great honor. Definitely. Well, 
you know then from what you've been doing how much work they have done for you now. Cancer. You and read my report. report. Put you in the middle here. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, they've done a great job. We're going to get rid of this cancer. Well, I have a little more personal interest in it than I used to. I think so. Well, after all, we find out that it's nothing but a disease after all. We've licked all other diseases you know, that sometimes go considered incurable. Polio, diphtheria, typhoid fever, scarlet fever, smallpox. You, you've seen them all go. Yeah, I've seen them all yeah. go. <laughs> Well, I'm going to I'm gonna live to see this go. <laughs> well, I thank you for all that you've been doing. I thank them. But I can't yeah. wait. Dr. Vince here, his goal, when, I, when you pointed me, was to get rid of 50% by the year 2000. I said, Vince, that's not good enough for me. <laughs> he's, he's a I'm 90 now. I'll be 90 in May, and I said, we've got to get rid of it in the next 10 years, and I'm going to live to be 100. But we're going to get rid of it. So that's what I'm going to report to you today. I get my report ready and I'll tell you how we're going to do it. Well, that's all right. We've got a book here. Uh, Nancy, can I have this big book? The big book? Yeah. This is a codex of Leonardo da Vinci, which uh, opens. Yeah. And you want to come out? <laughs> that's it. This is the, the only Leonardo for your library, for me. Let me see this here. This, this is the only uh, translation. You know, he wrote mirror writing. He wrote so you couldn't read it unless you led up to a mirror. He didn't want anybody to know his secrets. And this is, I've got the first 10 copies going to the 10 presidential libraries of the presidents I've known, everyone, starting with Hoover, starting with here's Hoover, Franklin Roosevelt, Truman, Eisenhower, Kennedy, Johnson, Nixon, Ford. And you have number one. Well, <laughs> well thank you very much. It goes in your library. I'm glad you're counting backwards. <laughs> <laughs> Where is the Codex now? I, Where is the Codex? I'm here in Los Angeles. I'm building a new museum there. That's going to go with Fred Ryan right there to the, to the library. And thank you yeah. very much. We'll send this straight to the library. Thank you. Thank you. It'll be in, the original will be in my museum. We have a Leonardo Center there in Los Angeles. I'm building a new museum right next to the Kirkaby building there. Well. And uh, the original will be there. You got the report there, Nancy. And that is the report. <laughs> well, I thank you for it. Here's a report. This is a letter to you, transmitting the report. And here's a memorandum, so you don't have to read all that. <laughs> you just read the memorandum and you'll know everything that's in the report here. And I'm March 1st in New York. I'm hosting a dinner for 30 uh, leading citizens of this country. We're going to Vince DeVita is going to speak there, and Dr. Rosenberg. And Dr. Rosenberg, by the way, has come up with a new modified method, which is much more potent, but less toxic than the old method. Mm. And uh, he's only started, but he's had tremendous results. There is a memorandum. And one of the things I'm trying to do is to get, to get uh, Raise five hundred million dollars by private subscription. I have heard about that. Mm -hmm. We've got matching funds, and I've talked to, I've talked to Speaker Wright, Tony Coelho, by the way, is coming up to me to the meeting, and Alan Simpson, Ted Stevens. We're going to make it bipartisan, and I think that uh, if we had a another, this is the bypass budget that goes to only only the NCI. Is the only institution that can prepare it. I was asked by Congress that created it. And I don't think it ever gets to you to see it. <laughs> <laughs> but this is what we want to raise in money 
between what the budget is now and what the bypass is, and that'd be another billion dollars, will give us what we need. And if we can do that, I think we can, with the progress we've made in the last few years, I think we can really get rid of <coughs> most cancers but, but in 10 years. You'll be still around, so you have a chance to benefit by it. There's a lot of yes. exciting new things going on. This is a research. letter of the, of the Codex, transmitting the Codex to you. And here is a, an invitation when you go to Moscow. And by the way, I want to congratulate you on that. INFPD, I think well, thank one you. of the most historic things that's ever happened in my six, 70 years relation to the Russians. You're the first one that has really found a way <laughs> to make a deal with them. <laughs> and uh, and uh, I think your trip to Moscow is going to be fantastic. It's going to be a sensation. I'm, I'm looking forward to it. And, uh, and I, I wanted, when you're there, I have built a trade center there, which they call Hammer House. Mm. And I want to give a reception, to give it to your scheduling people, and we'll have all the business people of Moscow. You want me to come. take that? Yes. Yeah. All right. Come. Uh, and. Uh, This is a transmittal letter. No. And last but not least, uh, May 25th is my birthday. I'll be 90. And if you're in town, <laughs> you know, Nancy, you've got to be at the, at the Kennedy Center, the Philharmonic, uh, Russell Publish is going to uh, play. We're taking over the whole Kennedy Center there that night. We're going to have 1,200 guests. It's a and, small uh, party. <laughs> uh, 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 Isaac Stern is going to play, and, and uh, Kiri T. Yukawa, great singer, is going to sing. If you have a chance, if you're here, Nancy, here. If, if we, and then that's if we don't know right now down there in the spring, what with <laughs> the summit and all of the dates that are still uncertain. Uh, uh, so I hope I'm in the United States. Uh, well, I think that uh, that completes my. Well, thank my you. visit, and I'm so grateful to you for seeing me. Well, thank you very and much, and thank you for keep on doing the great things you're doing. Well, because I think that uh, the world needs you. And uh, if, if, in addition, I've had two dreams. One was to bring about peace between East and the West, and you've already on a way to make that dream come true. Well, and the other dream I have is to get rid of cancer, and I think you can help too. <laughs> so you can go down history right. as the president who's done two miracles. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, Mr. President, I want to thank you for what you did. And by the way, if you get a chance, call President Zia. Wish him well. Oh, President Zia. Yeah. That'll help him. All right. Okay. Doctor, good to see you, sir. Goodbye. Goodbye. I got some answers. I shall. All right. Thank you very much. Great to see you. Thank you, Mr. President. All right.